The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States government. This is not a test. Repeating, this is not a test. This is a global emergency. At 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time some person's head collapsed into a black hole. It seems that some dude in Michigan managed to grasp the sheer size of Graham's number. You know that number discovered by mathematician Alexander Graham. It is best known as G64. I assume that nobody cares about advanced mathematics because the world is coming to an end. Of course nobody cares about some large number. We're all going to die Paul. Shut the fuck up about mathematics. I just hope that the Jonas Brothers and Millie Cyrus are not in heaven. I don't like either of them. Come on. Some dude by the name of either Channel 48 or Lincoln had his head collapse into a goddamn black hole after comprehending a large number. You should care about education. Oh wait, you probably failed kindergarten several times. I literally don't care Paul. We are going to be dead in 10 minutes. I just might smoke that crack I hid in the EAS server room. Who the hell cares? Shut up Scansoft Tom. I am going to finish this damn alert. Anyways the black hole will consume the earth within 10 minutes. You are advised to gather with loved ones and friends. There is no chance of surviving this disaster. Don't you start with that cliche talk about gathering with loved ones and friends. Come on, in every EAS scenario on YouTube about the end of the world, the video creators force us to say a motherfucking Bible verse, and say stand by for the last playing of the national anthem. It is always, that 1980s Air Force commercial. Can't any EAS creator use a different version of the national anthem? Please. Okay I will agree that most of the apocalypse EAS videos on YouTube have become cliche. That said, it is part of our job. Hey Paul and Scansoft Tom. You forgot that last playing of the national anthem. I will start playing it on TV. I would have said a Bible verse but I cannot remember any. Oh hell no. No more cliches. I will put something different on TV. I guess that's pretty awesome. Excuse me. Touch the rainbow. Taste the rainbow.